Okay, you'll be hearing from us. Oh, I could care less. The captain. Yeah, I mean, uh, I'll do a lap real quick and then I'll hop no, out. No, no, we're going to start got, walking that way. I ain't got much time anyways. Sir, so. I told you this is not actually open to the public. Legally, walk sir, legally. I can tell you my name as soon as you walk right outside. Well, uh, what is it? Yeah. I can tell you my name as soon as you walk out. What is it, Jimenez? Like I Jimenez? said. What's going on, Bay Fam? It's your boy, Bay Area Transparency, and we're back at it once again. And for this video, we're in the city of Martinez, California, and I'm about to show you what it looks like when our public employees, our public servants, allow their emotions to dictate their actions. I'm not going to say too much about this video, but I will let you know it is going to be a banger for sure. So tune in till the end, baby, because we're doing it in this video. As always, the first person to find the hit and misspelled word will get their comment pinned all the way to the top of the comment section. All you have to do is comment what the word is that I misspelled or misused and the timestamp you found it at. It won't be an exaggerated word. It won't be missing punctuation or anything like that. Like I said, it'll be misspelled or misused. Go follow us on Instagram at Bay Area Transparency. We're growing the Bay Fam on Instagram. We still have a lot of things in the works. Sometimes it just takes a while to get these things pumping and moving, but we are moving. We are making forward progress. I've been gathering a lot of content. I know you guys haven't heard from me for like 10 days, but I've been gathering, gathering, gathering. I've been busy, baby. We've been working. And for those of you that have been asking, the, that little thanks button you guys see below the video next to the like button and the share button and all that stuff, it's like a super chat and people have been asking how to donate there's also donation information in the description of the video you guys want to do that if you choose to it's there for you if not just watch the video and like the video baby that's all i ask for is bay area transparency and i'm out let's get to it nope lady's coming out go ahead um, are you, can i help you oh uh yeah is this open no are you this is not open? This is the training center. Oh, it's a training center? Mm -hmm. Okay, what was your name? I'm Kim. Kim? Okay, good to meet you, Kim. Appreciate Kim. it. Okay. That's my, my only question. Was it open? Oh, are you looking for something specific? No, just looking around. Kind of taking a tour, Too walking much. through. Okay, all right. Yep, this cool. Is part, this is part of the probation department. Gotcha. So it's like just a the training center for probation, so. Gotcha. Okay. Okay, cool. All right. Awesome, thank you. Mm -hmm. All right, so this is part of the probation training. Hello. What's going on, Bay Fam? It's your boy, Bay Area Transparency, and we're back at it once again, baby. Today we are at the Contra Costa County Sheriff's Administration and Emergency Operations Center. Hello, how you doing? Pretty good. No, I'm good. Appreciate it. Uh, just taking some pictures right now of everything, the whole, the building. Look out. Sir, excuse me, what are you taking pictures of? You're just taking pictures. How are you doing today? Uh, what was your name? I can give you a badge number. Okay. It's 90154. Okay, thank you. Is there something specific that you're looking for that I can help you with? No, not really. Just taking a bunch of pictures. No, I'm good. Appreciate it. Video. Okay. Is there something we can help you with? 
No? Good. Okay. Uh, please don't photograph the staff unless you need to. Uh, reason why you're I, need, I need to, yeah. Mm -hmm. Why, sir? Uh, just for my own reasons, my own personal reasons. Go get top. You know, sometimes it's about who pulls up to talk to you or who comes out. Because if she was solo, she would have been freaking. Can I help you? No, I'm good. Appreciate it. Uh, what was your name? Ma'am, what was your name? Just trying to get people's names so I can know who I'm speaking with. What was your name? McGuire, 89081. Awesome, thank you. You're welcome. Your task with following me around, huh? Nah, I'm just taking that shirt. Not following you at all. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I played this game many, many times. Or not this game, this law. Your sergeant didn't. What, uh, what, what would you say? It happens when you get old, you realize? When I get old, you, I'm just old. Yeah, no, I, I'm just, what do you mean by that? Like about the law and the way it works, or? No, no I'm, just, I'm just old, that's all. But what do you realize? That I'm old. Oh, well, we didn't say nothing about you being old. <laughs> oh, I did, I did, all good. Oh, got you. You said, yeah, you said it happens when you get old and you realize, and I thought you were referring to, like, your guys' job and the, the no. law and the way it works and no. things like that. No. That would have been an awesome comment. I was like, holy no. shit, he no. said something cool. No. <laughs> you know, because that's really what it is. You know, I don't know how old your sergeant was, but a lot of the younger cops are, like, gung-ho, like, you know, we're ready to ready to freaking run a marathon all the time, and you got the older guys who've been around and kind of know and understand. No, I'm, I'm, and I'm just very familiar with you guys, so sorry. Gotcha. What's your uh, What's your position? Me? Yeah. I'm a deputy. Well, if you do your job the way you're acting right now, then we appreciate your service. That's for sure. Thank you. They're looking at me now. Now they see me. Yep. Look at it. Are they coming or not? Looks like it. Yep. I'll let this guy out. He's coming out. There you go. Can I help you? No, I'm good. Appreciate it. What are you doing? Uh, taking pictures. How you doing? Who are you with? By myself. You just come in? What was that? You just came in? Well, are yeah, I had anything? to get in here somehow. I'm here by myself. What are, you, what are you doing? I just told you that. Well, that's not helpful. What's not helpful? I'm taking pictures. See okay. it. You can see it, right? Okay. Yeah, I mean, that's taking pictures. How you doing? Okay, there's the officer. He must have went. And uh, what was your name again? Rick. Uh, do you have a last name or a badge number? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> All right, am I sure he said Rick or did he say something else? Jesus. Got that one. Okay, so this is the door in the parking lot I'm talking about. We're going to go ahead and check it out. Um, let's see if it opens. See where I can go and how. Oh, yep. I just hit the handicap thing. Caution automatic door. I don't see anything about prohibited. You can't be on this side or anything like that, so... I'm just gonna kind of take a walk around. Um, obviously, you can be back here if it's wide open, you know. So you can just walk out here. You can be back here. So is this their fucking back parking lot? How come? How come this is all open? All right, we got some random person coming. Mm 
don't know if he's an officer or not. Yeah. Uh, this is the uh, employee secured parking lot. This part's actually not open to the public. So I'm going to have to have you come with me and go back inside the lobby. It was, it was right open. I know, but that's an entrance or an exit for people to come out here, employees to come out here. Why doesn't it say that, though? I can put a sign up if you'd like me to. Yeah, I mean, but you I'm guys have you to. You guys have to because it's okay. open. I mean, if, if there's no sign up, nothing telling us, and the door is wide open to the public, it's open to the public. Okay. So, well, I'm letting you know, so why don't you come on back with me? And uh, what's your name? Jonathan Joukowsky. Oh, uh, and you got a badge number? Yeah, it's 65940. Okay. And what's your position? I'm a captain here in professional standards. Okay, captain. Yeah, I mean, uh, I'll do a lap real quick and then I'll hop no, out. No, no, we're going to start got, walking that way. I ain't got much time anyways. Sir, so. I told you this is not actually open to the public. Legally, to sir, legally right now, I'm clear because this was wide open to the public. Okay, but now Whether I've you come, you that it's not. Yeah, but that's not how it works. There has to be signage up and all that stuff. Okay. So, being fair, I'm going to do a lap real quick, and then I'm right out of here. Right. Okay, Let's does that, that work? Okay, all right. I'll wait for you here. So, so, like I said, yeah, you guys have to put a sign up because the right, way those... I'll do that. The way you just the, go to your lap. You told me that well, we Well, I'm just trying up. to talk to you. No, okay, but you said, and I'm going to get it. I'm going to get the lot, the sign up. So, you uh, I'm just lap? trying to tell you the way it works. So okay. you, the way it works is if there's no signage or anything sign. stopping us, like if I can push that, even if there's a sign, if I can push, well, I guess if there's a sign, you'd be clear. But if I can push that door wide open, look at this guy's so hard headed. He's not even listening to me. I am listening to you. I'm still listening to you. If I could push that door open I heard you. and there's no sign, mm -hmm. legally I'm here. You guys can't then come out and say, hey, but we're telling you such and such because that's okay, not the way it is. So it's open. Wouldn't we be in danger of violating a fire code potentially if we have a sign up saying it's for employees only, but someone needs to use it in an emergency and they can't get through it? Well, I mean, that's on your guys' design team. I don't know how to, tell, how to go about okay. fire codes. It's not my thing. My thing is, I know I can walk through that sign. There's no sign that, or that door. There's no sign that says employees only. So legally, I'm allowed to be back here. I'd take the arrest happily. So, I'm and I, well, I'm just saying, like, I wouldn't leave. You could get 20 guys out here. I wouldn't leave. You guys ha would have to. Huh? But because I'm, I got time constraints right now, I actually have to get home. That's why I said I'll do a lap and then I'll be out of here. But yeah, legally, huh? I could be back here. So right. awesome. All right. So we got a uh, captain, I forget his name, uh, and they caught themselves, man. I mean, this is definitely like, like a back parking lot, I guess. Um, I figured it was just open, you know, because it was open and you can come back here. But like they got a door wide open and they're saying, oh, no, this is just our only, you know, police only or employee only parking lot. And uh, I mean, hey, sorry, man, you guys got a sign up or don't have a sign up. You got a door that's wide open everybody could get in or out of that door and uh so we're good you know so at this point i'm good oh look we got a green uh like a gray this is an undercover car for sure but it's got the cal exempt plate but it's definitely undercover there's another one toyota camry it's undercover for sure it's got the cal exempt but you know sometimes people don't look for those cars or whatever when you're driving maybe you know five miles an hour over the speed limit so anyways this guy knew there was nothing he can do um he knew right away he was screwed and so he said okay do your lap and i could stay back here if i wanted to i just don't i, I gotta go so anyways we got some toyota priuses so I looked as I was walking by and there was a couple cops sitting here looking for me and they were on the phone uh, just waiting for me probably telling whoever's going to follow me where I'm going yeah so they're just waiting to follow me are you guys the ones that are going to follow me so you got vehicle 3615 she was on the phone trying to stay off the camera but these are the ones who are going to follow me now all right, been about 15 minutes since I left the sheriff's department. And looky, looky what we have. We got, oh, that's a Lafayette police. Okay. And here goes the sheriff in the canine car. So we got, they, they use, looks like they use the Lafayette police car. And then now we have this sheriff's in the canine 3615.
Hey, what was that? What are you taking pictures of? Oh, just everything in the office. How are you doing? Where are you from? Huh? Where are you from? Where am I from? Yeah. The moon. Oh. <laughs> where are you from? Do you, you work for the county? Oh, where are you from first? I told you. Are you do you work for the county? Where are you from? <laughs> I do not work for the county. I'm just curious where you're from. All right. They got, look at this abomination right here. We have the flag of tyranny right under the actual flag. That's interesting. Ring the doorbell, push one unlock. Oh. Hello, how are you? Oh, I'm just gonna grab some cards right here real quick and take some pictures. I said I'm going to grab some cards and take some pictures. What for? For myself, a little story. Um, I'm sorry? You can't understand me or? Well, I don't know what you're looking at for. Oh. You can't just come in here and take pictures. Say it again? You can't just come in here and take pictures. Oh, why is that? I didn't, I didn't know that. The sheriff's office. Oh. How you doing? Okay. How can I help you? Good. Um, like I told her, I'm just gonna grab some cards and take some pictures. What is this for her? Uh, for myself, a little story that I got going on. Okay. Well, you can't really film on inside facility. You can film the outside if you want to, but preferred that you don't do it in here. Oh, okay. Um, all right, so is it preferred that I don't do it or am I not allowed to do it? It's not that you're not allowed, but we're basically not having anybody take pictures of Bianca facilities. Cruz. Oh, but I am Security allowed to though. Involved. This is part of the Sheriff's Department. Right, but I'm allowed to, right? Not necessarily, but I'm asking you to leave. There's no reason to further. Are you filming right now? Oh, correct. Yeah, for Without sure. Without any notice? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Did I so have that's to... why I'm asking you. To oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know I had to give you a notice. Well, so what do you guys need? Like something in writing? With the camera? Do you need something in writing, like, to give notice, or? Uh, you can, if you'd like to give us notice, but I don't know uh, what the process is. I can probably send it up the chain and see what, uh, whether or not uh, photos would be acceptable. Oh, okay. Uh, but this is, this is the public building, right? Uh, it is a county building, yes, part of the Sheriff's Department. So, it's, so it is public? That's correct. Okay. Yeah, so then I should be good, right, to take pictures in public? Like I said can't you have individuals here and we prefer that you don't take pictures of us as well gotcha so can you please exit but you, how long have you been employed I'm here i'm asking very nicely i know and i'm just asking nice questions i'm uh, not being I mean. if you'd like to we can walk right outside and uh so how long have you been employed here once again i'm gonna ask you to leave before i make a phone call right now have you been, i'm just asking have you been here a while because i'm trying to explain I'm to you this you so because nicely. this is a public building and this is a public area, right? I'm gonna ask you very nicely. Can you please walk out of this facility right now? Oh, I walk into the hallway. Yeah, we really don't want to have you taking pictures in here. So please just. No, I understand. I have to get some pictures though. You guys can no, be out of them. That it's fine with me if you don't want to be in them. Can you call? But I gotta. Right now? I gotta get some pictures. Ask for a deputy. So, um, yeah, that's fine. Can I have one of these candies right here? No, you may not right now. I can't have one of these candies? Not at the moment. Are they not for the public? So I can't have a candy that's for the public. Yeah. So Bianca Cruz is calling the deputies for some reason. Just trying to do my story like I told them, but. What are you affiliated with? What story, what, uh, is there a news facility or? Uh, company? It just kind of like a, a private, uh, private press, you know? Private press. Mm -hmm. So. Right. And what was your name? I can tell you my name as soon as you walk right outside. Well, uh, what is it? Yeah. I can tell you my name as soon as you walk out. What is it, Jimenez? Like I Jimenez? said. Jimenez? And, and 
Why, why is it that I can't have a candy? Are these here for the public? You are asking nicely, too. I know, but I don't have to leave. That's what you don't understand. This is a public building. That's why I asked you how long you've been working here. I understand. There are security measures here that we need to this, That's not one of them. Because this, there's the First Amendment. When, when there's the First Amendment, and we're allowed to yeah. take pictures. He's coming up. Yeah, okay. There's the First Amendment, and we're allowed to take pictures. I completely understand. So, yeah, so then I don't have to leave. There so your request is that we is, need to make sure that we. Oh, eat, so. th then you guys would secure anything you need to beyond this. But since this is the public area, this would be okay for me to take pictures. Of. Kind of like how you have the no admittance authorized personnel, right? Perfect. And I wouldn't cross that because that would be breaking the law, and I don't break the law. Um, so, anyways, but I'm just really concerned that you have candy out here for the public and you're telling me i can't have one if you like a candy go ahead and take a candy well why is it that you said no <laughs> because just because i, I was doing because i was doing something outside. you didn't like you can take a candy and you can walk on in. you can't say no because i was doing something you didn't like <laughs> well, you guys you're, don't have any kind of like, like anyway do you like how you doing it's okay Good, how are you hi sir how's you it going somebody taking photos and videos and we prefer that he Yeah, I mean, he can videotape, you know, anywhere publicly accessible. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. So, obviously, we want to make sure that for security reasons that, that we don't uh, have too many photos happening because of what we do here. So, without any the, knowledge about... Then it would be on you security. guys to secure and handle your security on the other side of this desk, but this is a public area. Okay. Yep. You yeah, are? I know. So you're okay <laughs> with him being here? Yeah. It's not about okay, sir. It's my actual right. That's what I was trying to tell you. I, I understand completely. It's free press. We just normally don't have anyone that's not law enforcement here mm -hmm. because of what we do here. Right. So and that's, and that's why to. this is a good thing because now we're all educated and maybe we won't react the way you did right now again, right? So it's a good thing. We have now all been educated on it and it's a good thing, you know. That's That's why. It may be a good thing for you, but we obviously don't want to advertise what we do here, so. Well, <clears throat> so this is not a private business, and so that's partly why I do this, to kind of educate public workers like you. You guys are public workers. Everything you guys do here, most of it, is public record, right? And we can pretty much gain access to a lot of those records um, at certain points. And so you guys aren't doing anything very private, and if you had confidential information, it would be secured behind this because if you didn't do that, you guys wouldn't be doing your job correctly. So that's partly why we do this. So now you're educated. If somebody comes back and records, you will understand that they totally have the right to, as well as your staff. So it's a good thing. And I'm being respectful. The way you got jumpy at me, I didn't have to be, but I always try to conduct myself professionally, so. Okay. Just so you're aware, we've had other people come in that are not acting professionally, and we like to minimize that by not giving them access to our office area. See, so we prefer that people Again, you're confused about those this. experiences. Right, you're confused so. about this. You guys don't have a choice but to give people access to this public lobby. You really don't. That's the confusing part. Like if I would have left and you guys would have locked me out and not let me back in, it's actually a violation of our constitutional right to be in a public building, right? And so you guys don't have that choice. So don't do that because you're going to open the county up to a lawsuit. It's not a good idea. Yeah, no, there's no confusion about it. Right. We're publicly accessible. Right. You know, you have right. the right to record. Oh, yeah, for sure. And what was your name? Is it really? Uh, Mike Rector. Rector. Okay. And Sergeant? Yes. Cool. cool. I appreciate you, man. Thank you. you okay. Yeah, so I'm, I'm good. I'm just going to take some pictures, and then I'll be on my Go way. Ahead. And, uh, yeah, we're cool. we got cool. a lobby downstairs. Cool. I've already been down there. They were, they were, they, they were All right. freaking out, so I left. <laughs> oh, anyway. Cool. And I just need to get some of these well, cards. I'll be downstairs. If you've got any questions, oh, tell them what we do here. I'm always happy to help okay. answer questions. Appreciate you. Uh, Mr. Rector, what was your name again? Uh, Mike Rector. No, no, I mean, not your name. Jesus, badge your number, badge number. There uh, you go. 706. Okay, highlight Mr. Rector there. He's uh, awesome. Awesome, awesome. And we will, uh, now we have Bianca Cruz, who's been educated. Kyle Jensen's been educated. And Mr. Jimenez right there is now educated to the fact that this is okay to, uh, this is literally our right to be in here and, and do this. So 
that's a good thing man and it was all done professionally and respectfully no issues no arguing no foulness except on maybe mr jimenez's part where he got a little jumpy and tried to kick me out told me i couldn't have some candy but uh at least we got that taken care of so here he is joaquin jimenez forensic supervisor and he's saying that because people have gotten attitudes in here they like to uh, not let people into the public lobby and that's 100 percent not okay <laughs> um and now he knows that so that's a good thing so yeah this has been a positive interaction for the most part um on my part and we have um you the goal? so what's your name uh, what's your policy on taking photographs Once of again, public citizens what's your name What's your policy on taking photographs of public citizens? There's no policy that I'm going to state right the now. The sheriff's office has one. I know it. And, and you can look it up. And if you, you are like. not supposed so to be me, taking a picture of me. I'm letting you know that right now. I'm, I'm letting you know that I'd like you to leave. It but doesn't matter what you'd you like. Don't want to. It doesn't matter what you like. So, you were just told that. I understand. And educated on it. But I'm letting you know your guys' policy says you're not supposed to take pictures of somebody unless they're suspected of a crime. So you're breaking the policy. We will definitely be holding you accountable for that, sir. So please go back do to work. You have to do. You're dismissed, bud. We don't need you, okay? <laughs> no one needs to dismiss anybody here. I'm just dismissing you. Rude. We don't we don't need you. That is rude. Oh, you're you're, hey, you're a public servant. I'm being respectful. You're Are dismissed, you? babe. Are you really saying that? You're dismissed? Babe, it's good, okay? We're good. Are you saying that though? I am saying because that you, you are, are dismissed. Each other out, evidently. You are dis you are dismissed. I am saying that. Yeah, okay. I got it on film. Once again, I can walk around. Joaquin. It's our Joaquin. Yes. It's our office. You can, but you go you. ahead and leave me alone. You're dismissed, but go back to work. So okay. Are you? Uh, and uh, awesome. And you, you see, you, you have you learned you don't have that authority. Jesus, what a knucklehead, man. Well, uh, whiteboard, uh, glass whiteboard. Uh, hey, what's, your, what's your YouTube channel? Oh, I don't give it. Oh, I'm trying to go down. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, good. Oh, good. Yeah, I usually don't give it. a lot of the videos. I'd like to see those. You, you, they'll send them to you guys. They're going to give you a huge shout out because of how you did. So you, you'll, I can guarantee you, you'll see it. <laughs> but I don't like to give it until I put out the, put out the uh, video. But good job, bro. Thank you. You too. That guy was awesome, man. Hello, how you guys doing? Oh, and I'm just gonna take some pictures around. Excuse me. What are you doing? Going in? Right. Yeah, what are you taking pictures of? Oh, everything. Just taking pictures. But why? Um, because I like to take pictures. Why is that? Why are you asking? Who are you? I'm the office manager of public works. Office manager of public works. What was your name? Why, I'm just curious why you're taking photos here. Oh, like I said, I just like to take photos. I'm, I do stories and stuff like that. So. I don't know that you can. I'm going to tell security just for safe, like our own safety. Okay. I, is it unsafe? Are pictures unsafe? Well, we don't <laughs> have people come in here and take pictures. This is a, a government agency. Do you guys have cameras? Um... Can't that. Well, I'm, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go if you want to stay, you can. Oh, okay. Go ahead. Um, pretty sure you have cameras, so pretty sure you guys are getting pictures taken all day, you know? Yeah, but we don't really have people that come in and take photos. Oh, okay. If you want to that's fine. Oh, I'm just gonna look, take some pictures over here. Let's get some here. Her here. What the heck? She's like tripping off. Can I help you? No, I'm good. Appreciate it. Oh, she's coming out. Taking pictures for a day? Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Did you get it figured out? Oh, and what was your name? No, I'm not giving my name. Ma'am, don't you work here? You work for the public. You're supposed to give us your name. No, I don't have to. I'm <laughs> She didn't want to give me her name, but she sure gave me your name, didn't she, Joe? <laughs> so what? I didn't tell his last name. 
you're supposed to give us your first name, so I, ma'am, I need to document who I'm speaking with. Okay, have a good one. Okay, you'll be hearing from us. I could care less. Oh, I could care less. Hmm. Interesting. Sure, what, a, what a foul attitude that lady has. No, I'm good. All right. Have a good day. Yep, you too.